Karna's strongest weapon was his will. Possessing a strong will and a strong heart, he was the hero of charity who had never resented a single person despite experiencing all kinds of misfortune. He was a man who had given things special than anyone else, but never once was treated special himself. In Mahabharat, Karan is known to be the only warrior who could match Arjuna. He was a key warrior who aimed to kill the third Pandav Arjuna but dies in a battle with him during the war. Karna was a great warrior, in many ways greater than Arjuna. They may have been equal as archers, but physically, Karna was by far the stronger of the two. Karna was reputed for his charity. Even at the time of death when Lord Krishna in the guise of an old Brahman begged to give the fruit of all his good deeds, Karna had not hesitated, said Salam Rukmani Ammal in a discourse. Karna was an exceptional warrior, often considered equal to or even superior to the Pandavas in combat skills. His fits in battle, including his use of divine weapons, earned him admiration. In the Mahabharat, it is clearly mentioned that Karna, son of Kunti and Surya, the sun god, was born with natural armor and earrings. Earth goddess cursed Karna that his chariot will get struck in line which will lead to his death and ascent cursed Karna that Karna would die when he is weaponless as Karna killed his cow when it was helpless. Krishna spurred Arjuna to kill Karna in that situation.